he's bigger than my mountain. Oh Lord, he's bigger than my valley. He's bigger than my problem. He's bigger than my pain. Oh God, oh yes he is. God is faithful. He's bigger than my mountain. Oh, he's bigger than my valley. He's bigger than my problem. He's bigger than my pain. Oh God, oh yes he is. God is faithful, God is faithful now, faithful, God is faithful to perform, oh yes he can, perform his plan, God is so faithful now, oh yes he is now, God is Oh, yes, he can perform it well. He's bigger than my mountain. Oh, he's bigger than my valley. He's bigger than my power. He's bigger than my pain. Oh, God. God is faithful. He's bigger than my mountain. Oh, Lord, he's bigger than my valley. He's bigger than my problem. He's bigger than my pain. Oh, God. Oh, yes, he is. God is faithful. Hallelujah. It's good to know that we've got a God who's faithful. If you don't know him, you need to get to know him for yourself. We thank God this morning for another privilege, another opportunity to gather here in this sanctuary. Glad this morning. Very happy that those of us who are here decided to come and be with us. And for all of you, my brothers and sisters, wherever you might be this morning, around your telephones, your uh, iPads, and whatever other instruments of communication that you might have, thank you for joining us. I pray this be up on a few Amen. And we have a little technical difficulty going on here. Uh, is there another microphone someplace? Uh, hallelujah. Glory to God.
can't deal with them by yourself. They're beyond what you can do if you're just right for God. Just right for God. When you pray, you're telling God that something outside of yourself that needs an answer. There is something you're telling God that I can't deal with this by myself. By myself. Pastor, and I'm, I'm not the conclusion to the matter, and I cannot fix everything. I need to have proof. God expects you to go to the center of your table for whatever that is. Wherever it is that you can go, you need to do that. Whatever you can do for yourself, do that. And there comes, there comes a point where you just flat out can't go any further. It's at that point that you are humble. You are humble. You, this, is, this is where you meet God and to what God can do for you. You, you. you need at this point a personal relationship with God. Prayer causes you to humble yourself. Psalms 10, 16, 17 says that the Lord is king forever and ever and even the uh, perished out of his land. Lord, thou hast heard the desires of the humble. Thou will prepare thy heart. Thou will cause thy Thank you. 
children are working for me. God gave me what I need to make sure that my children were were, 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 uh, uh, educated enough and and, and capable enough to be able to work for themselves. Yeah, I want to see my grandchildren doing something. My grandchildren, my kids, I'm capable. Lord, yeah. Thank you. 